what's up computer and people it's been a minute since we talked uh i figured i'll give you a little update um so i did my first week first round of chemo it was the worst round worst week of my entire life i was throwing up for fucking hours on end i'm, I'm happy i'm a little better now bless but um uh, it, it was the worst week of my entire life. I had to get hospitalized. I lost like 10 pounds. Uh, I'm already really skinny, so it was just a bitch to lose that weight. I couldn't keep nothing down, not even a fucking cup of water, not even a fucking ice cube. I was vomiting everything up. Um, but now we're coming on. You, I get a two-week break after that, which I already did a week of it in the fucking hospital, and I'm doing the other week. I'm staying with my pops right now and his wife. And uh, I can't lie, I've been painting. I've been working on music. Today I went to Brooklyn to the studio. Tomorrow I'm going to another studio. I'm finishing the album right now. I'm working on my next album and a mixtape. So we're doing all that stuff. And then next week, on Monday actually, I go back in for chemo again. But this time I'm staying at the hospital. Um, it should be interesting. Um, it's 11 weeks, so even the day, the weeks off count as weeks during, during chemo because that's the brewing your system or whatever. So in those weeks off, I'll be able to do more stuff and bring my microphone and everything to the hospital, so it should be good, but it's two in the morning right now, and I just got real fucked up because I was, like, in the back of my hair, just, like, fucking with it, and I saw hair all over my fingers, and I started pulling, and it started coming out in clumps, right? Uh, like, obviously, chemo, hair, but, like, I didn't, I shaved my hair to try to take control of the whole situation, and the hair started coming back, and I liked how it was looking, and then I was just falling out, you know? And it just, like, I kind of forgot I had cancer because I'm kind of living my life besides having a cane and shit. I'm living my life, you know, and uh, creating art and working on a bunch of cool shit, poetry and paintings and raps and singing. And just, like, doing that and seeing all my hair in the sink, a lot of it in the sink, coming out just like nothing. It just really reminded me of what's going on right now. And it, it's heavy, you know. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get through it. I know I'm gonna beat. I know 100%. No matter how negative I get, I know I'm gonna beat it. You know, I'm like, I know I'm gonna beat it. That's, that's, that's what I keep telling myself. I'm gonna beat it. I'm gonna beat it. And y'all, are gonna, I'm gonna tour when I beat it. I'm gonna tour. I'm gonna do my top five cities plus New York four times. So New York, uh, another city. New York, another city. New York, another city. New York. I'm gonna do seven shows next year. 2025 tour. Mark my words. I'm gonna tour the entire U.S. or a big part of the U.S. And I'm so excited to do all that. That's what my mind's on right now. That tour, the albums, and the cool shit. You know, I'm not gonna let nothing else fuck with me. Um, and just creating and being creative and creating ideas and just thinking, uh, writing poetry and things like that. Um, but I feel like it's right to come here and give y'all updates and whatnot. Because y'all have been so loyal and good to me that I feel like the better, the, the least I can do is return it back to y'all. You know, that's 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 that. I feel strong. You know, I've been eating a lot and really trying to gain weight. It's hard as fuck to gain weight for me though. I'll tell you that. I'm trying, uh, you know. I guess it's a good problem, but not right now. Like, yeah, I'm gonna show y'all. Look, just look at that. It just comes out of the back of my fucking head. I don't even know. Put that in the garbage just comes out of the back of my head like nothing so i'm gonna I'm shave it again tomorrow down to the skull and hopefully it don't grow back all weird because i can't it's just i don't know there's just seeing it tangibly happen like that is very stressful for me I, I don't know if that makes any sense but yeah fuck it though we gonna keep pushing though fuck it though you know this is this shit don't got shit on me um or us you know and everyone that's watching these videos and commenting and staying to the end, I appreciate y'all so much. I love y'all so much. I live for y'all. Um, this is this is tough, you know. This is a lot, but ain't shit we can't handle, you know. I'm nervous to go back into chemo, but you know what? We just gonna do it, cause what the fuck else could we do? I love y'all and thank y'all for being strong with me. Be your own best friend. I got an album dropping in May. Basically a month from now, another album, hold it down, stay naked, stay you. I love y'all. Goodbye.